welcome back to my life as Roxy and on my channel I post skinky, hair care as well as health and fitness videos and today's video is an update on my water fast. I was supposed to do a 21 day water fast but I actually just did a 10 day water fast which consisted of 5 day water fast each. Basically what I did is I did a 5 day water fast, I had an eat day and then I did another 5 day water fast but then I ended my water fast. I don't really have a specific reason on why I ended my water fast. My first, my second week was so much better than my first week but I was just not in that positive energy to want to continue with the water fast. So basically that's my excuse with what's going on in the world right now i just didn't feel like doing a water fast anymore honestly i don't have any excuses but yeah i'm here to post a video to tell you how my experience was how much weight i lost during the water fast i'm going to show you some clips with the clips you can see what i went through during the entire two two or two five day water fast or ten day water fast so basically i started at 82 kgs i'm going to show you the weight in pounds on the screen i started at 82 kgs and then i ended my water fast at 78 kgs so i lost a total of 8.8 .8 pounds during my water fast i know that's not a lot but i'm happy um i'm happy um i really appreciate this time that i did the water fast um i really listened to my body and i can also see the difference especially with my arms and my butt and my legs but i'm going to show you of course i'm going to show you some pictures so that you don't just go off based on what i'm telling you so i'm going to insert the pictures right here so as you guys can see um you can see quite a difference in my body especially in my abdominal area and my legs as well as my butt you can see a difference it might not be such a huge difference but you can definitely see a difference i'm going to show you the before and afters of the water fast as well as the before and afters before the one month alternate day fasting so basically basically i'm going to show you the difference of a one month and 10 day difference yeah pictures before and afters of one month and 10 days so now that you've seen all the pictures please comment down below what you think do you can you see the difference um did you um, do a water fast? What was your experience with a water fast? And before I go on to the um, clips, which will show you my whole, my feelings during or what I went through during the water fast. I just want to say guys, if you're new to my channel, please take the time to subscribe. And if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and comment down below guys. I really do appreciate appreciate the support but anyways here are the clips and you can see what i went through the entire two weeks or two five day waterfalls or ten day waterfalls so here are the clips and today is day one of my waterfalls um i'm attempting a 21 day water fast so that today is day one out of bed today but that's because i've been packing stuff and whatever but most of the time i'm just gonna rest i'm gonna see if i'm gonna try to um, exercise a little bit on my water fast but i just want to say tell you guys that i'm currently at 82 kgs I, today is day two of my 21 day water fast so this is just like a vlog type video telling you how i'm currently feeling on day two okay today day two has been quite easy for me um obvi obviously i've been having cravings but i know there's like a difference between feeling hungry and having cravings and sometimes we confuse the two with each other sometimes we claim to be how can i say we claim to be 
we claim to be hungry but actually we're just craving food and i think that's what i'm currently going through um one thing that i can also say is that as you go further into your fast you kind of taste like uh, um you have a strange taste in your mouth and that's currently that's why um i i brushed my teeth right now because i was having like a strange today is day three of my 21 day water fast basically today is a little bit tougher it's day three of my water fast the tongue problem is becoming really irritating like i feel my like my tongue my tongue is dried out i also feel a little bit like i don't have like energy in my body so i'm going to drink my electrolytes so that i can feel better but generally day three has been tougher than the previous days but i feel like my body can still go a long period of time without food it's not like i feel like this is the last and i can't go on with a water fast um i know i've been on a water fast before so i know that uh, you're gonna have days that you're gonna feel really fine and then you're gonna have days that you're gonna feel really bad this is not one of the days that i feel really bad but i don't feel as well as i did in the other on the previous two days but hopefully I will feel better tomorrow. I don't have any pains because normally they say you'll get pains and stuff. I don't have any pains on my water fast. Although I felt a little bit tired during the day, I don't really feel like exhausted, exhausted. Um, you'll probably see that I don't have that high energy, energy that I used to have. But I'm still doing great. I still feel fine. I didn't film yesterday because I totally forgot. I don't know what happened yesterday. Yesterday was day four. Today is day five. Yesterday was actually the day that I felt my best after the first three days. Um, today, I kind of feel bad again. That's why I said with, um, with water fasting, one day you will feel great and the next day you will feel bad. It's not like I'm feeling really, really bad. I just feel a bit off. The taste in my mouth. I brushed my teeth, but it really doesn't help. It just helps for maybe an hour and then the taste comes back and my mouth feels dry. But yeah, generally I'm still doing good despite the coronavirus panic. Uh, yeah, I don't know. <laughs> Like, I really don't know how far I'm still going to push. I hope I can finish the entire 21 days. And yes, um, I also wanted to give an update on my weight results. I started at 82 kgs. I'm currently at 80 kgs. So I lost a total of 2 kgs, which is 4.4 pounds. Yeah. I've been on a 21 day water fast and I finished 5 days and on a Unfortunately, I didn't go to day 6. I broke my fast on day 6 because I really, really, really felt terrible during this time. On day 6 or 5 o'clock this morning, I felt really, really bad. You know the taste that when you water fast, you get like a very, very bad taste. Your tongue turns white. And it was just like my mouth just had like extremely bad taste. So um, I brushed my teeth or I uh, it was two or three times that I brushed my teeth for the day. But when I brushed my teeth, it was just like for 30 minutes stops and then I felt bad again. So I was so like, like after that I brushed my teeth and then just a while after that I felt really nauseated. And then I threw up and when i threw up it was just like water but it was like an acid type of water it tasted really acidy acidic sorry not acidy acidic but anyways it was really bad so 
it wasn't like I felt extremely, I felt very bad, but it wasn't extreme where, where I needed to go to the hospital or anything of that sort. But then I decided, oh, I'm going to so break my fast. day 8 of the entire 21 days water fast. Like, one thing that I've realized that days go past very, 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 very slowly when you do a water fast. It's basically like you pray for the time to just fly by, but it goes, like, it goes past very, very slowly. But anyways, guys, um... So day today is day eight, which is, and I'm currently in the second cycle. I did the first cycle and I ate on day six. Um, now I am in the second cycle, um, which is day two. I still feel great. I still have three days left of this five days. And then on Sunday, I'm going to break my fast again. So today is Wednesday and then on Sunday, I'm going to break my fast again. And then start Monday to Friday and then Saturday, I'm going to break my fast again. And then just fast for the remainder of what is left of the 21 video to give you an update on how day 9 and 10, yeah, day 9 and 10 went. So today is Friday and it's going to end on Saturday. Saturday will be my last fast of the second cycle. And then Sunday will be my eat day. I can honestly tell you guys, Nim. It's kind of weird, but the second week of water fasting is so, so, so much easier than the first week. First week, I was drained. I had no energy. Whenever I had to stand up, I had to stand up very slowly. And basically, it was just, it was just a bummer. The whole first week was just terrible that's why i felt like changing up the water fast but honestly by the second week things are really easier i have more more energy like i feel great right now i have more energy and yeah i just feel generally i just feel better than i did last week I know it's not gonna be the same for everyone but I'm here to share my experience I don't feel tired I don't feel um, one thing that I can say is that I'm so worried about the fact that I haven't had any bowel movements yeah I'm worried about that but other than that um, I was hoping for the Epsom salt to help with that but currently still nothing so I'm a little bit worried about that because one thing I know about water fasting is if you don't have bowel movements after the after the fast is over you're gonna suffer from constipation and I am so worried about that because it was so terrible with my last fast I really hated it and that was one of the main reasons that I decided that I'm never gonna do a fast again but I don't want things to go that way um, now that you have seen all the clips and you've seen my experience during the water fast I just want to say guys thank you so much for the support I know there were days where it went up and I felt really great and there were days where I felt really bad um, it was kind of like a roller coaster during this water fast, but I can honestly say that my second week was so much easier than my first week, which is kind of weird. But yeah, it was so much easier. I think it's because my body got used to water fasting. But guys, I'm not going to talk too much in this video. I just want to say thank you for watching. And I will explain to you guys on my alternate day fasting. I'm back again on my alternate day fasting. I started on Monday, but I'm going to talk about that more in another video. So bye guys.